The Boxcar Children Collection, Volume 46, by Gertrude Chandler Warner, is a compilation of three mystery novels, each of which follows the Alden children, Henry, Jesse, Benny, and Violet, as they solve various mysteries. In the mystery of the grinning gargoyle, the Aldens visit their cousin Joe, who has been hired to restore the local college's chemistry and physics buildings. When they arrive, they find out that a gargoyle on one of the buildings Rooftops has been damaged, but it seems more like an act of vandalism than an accident. The gargoyle, mysteriously, has had a smile carved into its face. As the siblings begin to investigate, they discover that there might be a connection between the gargoyle and the recent thefts of rare books from the college library. The children meet various suspects, including a competitive construction company and a reclusive alumnus with a private museum of medieval artifacts. The children learn about the significance of the gargoyle, link the timings of the thefts with the vandalism, and work closely with their cousin to put together the pieces. Eventually, they unmask the thief, restore order, and save Joe's restoration project. The mystery of the missing pop idol takes the children to Pine Shore, where they take part in a music festival by helping out in their grandfather's booth. The excitement revolves around a talent contest where the winner gets to meet pop idol Kiki Pop. However, Jessie discovers that Kiki is missing just before her scheduled appearance. The festival is thrown into chaos with everyone wondering about the pop star's whereabouts. The Aldens encounter suspicious behavior from various individuals surrounding Kiki, including her manager and some contest participants who seem overly eager to take her place. As they dig deeper, the children find that there's more at stake than just the pop idol's performance, with intricate relationships and business deals behind the scenes. Utilizing their resourcefulness and attention to detail, the children navigate through misleading clues, finally finding Kiki and exposing the mastermind behind her disappearance. The pop idol gratefully performs for her fans, and the festival is deemed a success thanks to the Alden's intervention. In the mystery of the stolen dinosaur bones, the Alden children are excited to help set up a dinosaur exhibit at the Pickering Museum, where their friend, curator Dr. Iris Perez, has arranged for a shipment of dinosaur bones. However, the joy is short-lived when it turns out that the bones of a valuable dinosaur skeleton have gone missing. The museum staff are distressed, as the exhibit stood to bring a lot of public interest and educational opportunities to the community. As the Aldens start sleuthing, they encounter strange occurrences at the museum, including alarming noises and mysterious shadows. They meet other characters who show a peculiar interest in the exhibit, such as a competing paleontologist and a movie producer wanting to make a documentary about the find. By analyzing the peculiarities of the events surrounding the theft, the children uncover hints leading to the thief. It becomes a game of wits and observation as they carefully assess alibis and motives. Ultimately, they disclose the cunning plan devised to steal the bones, recover the stolen pieces, and ensure the exhibit opens on time. Through each of the stories in the Boxcar Children Collection, Volume 46, the Alden children use their collaborative problem-solving skills, their sharp observation, and their knack for understanding human nature to solve mysteries and bring about justice. The stories emphasize themes like perseverance, teamwork, and the power of curiosity. With each case, they leave a positive impact on the communities they are a part of, proving that no mystery is too perplexing for the boxcar children. You can listen to the full audiobook for free by following the URL in the description.